Yo, what's up, YouTube? Um, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to do a fake video call live using OBS Studio, Avatar file, and Google Meet. So, if you are new to the channel, click the subscribe button, turn on post notification. I post quality videos. You don't want to miss my next video, trust me. Now, to use OBS Studio, you need to go to the tool section, go to the auto configuration wizard, and uh, you want to choose how we'll only be using the virtual camera, and then next, and then apply the settings. Okay, so that way you get to use OBS Studio as a virtual camera. On your PC now OBS is running as a virtual camera on your PC so now you want to launch avatar file on your iPhone or rather before you do that you want to screen mirror your iPhone to your PC that way whatever shows on your iPhone shows on your PC screen okay I just started the virtual camera on OBS, so OBS is running on the virtual camera currently. Now I'm gonna screen mirror my iPhone to my PC. Basically, everything that shows in my iPhone screen shows on my PC screen. Okay, the apps that enable you to do this, I don't want to go into too much detail. So this video is not going to be long, but um, you can always DM me for more information. So now I'm going to screen mirror my iPhone to my PC. And you can see that what is on my iPhone is on my PC screen at the moment. I just screen mirrored my iPhone to my PC. Okay, that's the first step. So next you launch Avatar on your iPhone. Go to life mode, choose your avatar, which is your face. Now ensure your phone is in a stable position and you put your face in the comfortable position so that the avatar, which is your fake video call face, looks legit. Okay. You can see my face is cast onto my PC screen. Okay. We all know who this is so this is actually me but on my pc shows this person which is elon musk so yeah basically that's how it works so on your pc screen this was going to be showing ensure your face is as stable as possible you have the best camera keep your face comfortable okay so it appears very legitimate use good microphones that being said i hope you understand the concept DM me for more information now I'm gonna show you some other things on your Google Chrome you need to do some settings okay go to your settings you wanna go to your settings on your Chrome I'm um, go to privacy and security your settings it's very important you do this and then in the privacy and security section you go to site settings and then you go to camera now you want to select obs virtual camera by default it's going to be your normal camera or your webcam you want to select obs virtual camera that way your chrome knows obs virtual camera is what it's going to be using for video calls all right it's really important you do the settings okay prior to anything okay so your chrome is aware that you're using obs as a virtual camera you do the same with your microphone you want to use some good microphones okay so you have um a good um audio okay so you choose whichever microphone it is you're using and then you're good to go on your chrome so next your google meet Typically, this is what it looks like. You can see the OBS Studio sign. It's already the virtual camera. But let's start from the beginning. So I'm going to end this call. So basically, go to Google Meet. Okay. 
now this is the home page on google meets you want to go start a new meeting make sure you're the one that's going to start a meeting you start a new meeting all right click the new meeting button and then when you click the new meeting button you start an instant meeting okay start an instant meeting so it's going to take some time to load and then it's going to load up and then yeah you want to copy that link you're going to see a, a link you're going to see like a code like a link you send it to your client on their google meet for them to join and then they join you and then ensure you already have all of your setup in place you know so what they're going to see is what is cast on your obs virtual camera which you have screen mirrored with your iphone which is working off avatarify with your fake face so that's what they will see on their side of the video call and you're going to see them on your side of the video call so that's basically how it works okay i don't want to do it for real you didn't even get to my face i don't want to violate any youtube guidelines and uh, not you know put myself at risk so but you get the concept if you need more information you can always reach me dm me okay so google meets obs avatar file this also works for google chat whatsapp skype and a couple of others there's a workaround you just need to do to get it done correctly so keep the video call as short as possible you know basically use short words like hello how are you nice to meet you my name is so so okay nice to meet you hi uh, i got some stuff to do i probably want to go you know keep as short as possible